Good evening everyone, this is Bremster and tonight I'm trying a new puzzle from, well not a new puzzle, this is quite an old puzzle, but another puzzle from Quads on Parade. This is Quad Trigger by Realm Planner, which is another one that has been flagged as a moderately hard or a hard um, trick into the wilderness. So I've got to see how I go on this one. Um, this is using the global entropy constraint, which is something I've struggled with before in the past, but I have um, tried, I've recently solved another global entropy puzzle just on my own to knowing this was coming up. So um, yeah, we'll see how I go. So we've got normal Sudoku rules apply. So in every box, in every row, and in every column, the digits one to nine must be placed without repetition. We've got quadruples. So digits on quadruple circles must be placed at least once in the four cells touching that circle. So one and two will definitely go into those four cells. In here, we must put A7 and and or at least one seven and at least one eight. It might be possible for us to put two sevens. It's a bad example. Well, I can't, but I could be able to be able to put two eights in there, for example. That might be possible. Um, and then global entropy, which means in any two by two square that you can draw anywhere in the grid, there must be at least one low digit, one middle digit, and one high digit. Low being one, two, three, middle being four, five, six, and high being seven, eight, nine. I'm going to restart the puzzle to restart my timer. Let's give this a shot. So I can see some quadruple stuff straight away, such as two in this box can't go in those cells, two in this box can't go in those cells. So two is in one of those. So maybe there's some quadruple tricks I can do. I can do the same with fives down here. So five is in one of those. I can do the same with sevens here, so seven is in one of those. I can do the same with two here, so two is in one of those. I can do the same with two here. So two is in one of those, but it has to be on the quadruple, so two is in one of those. I can do the same with five here, so five isn't in any of those, so five is in one of those. That can't be a seven, because if that was a seven around this quadruple, the, um, the seven would have to be there, and around this quadruple, the seven would have to be there, and I've got a conflict. So that's not a seven. One is in here and in here, so one is down here, but it has to be on the quadruple. This, I don't think, is the way I'm supposed to start this puzzle. Five here and five here puts five in one of those. Yeah, I don't think this is the way I'm supposed to start this puzzle. There's a whole bunch of little stuff like that. Two in here means I can't put two on this quadruple here, so two is in one of those two. This doesn't feel like the way to start this puzzle, though, does it? Like, I'm, These deductions are true, but not helping. Like, none of these are really pointing at other quadruples. I'm using the quadruple clues to get these deductions, but they're not pointing at other quadruples to give me anything. So let's think about entropy. Okay, so there's two low digits in here, and there's two low digits in here, which means... Okay, so this is interesting. Yeah, this is going to be important. So let's see, how many low digits do I have in a row? I've got three, one, two, and three. So how many low digits do I have in two rows? Well, I've only got six because I've got one, two, three in each row. But in these two rows, I'm putting two low digits here and I'm putting two low digits here. So none of these cells can have low digits. Let me explain why. We know that there are four low digits in those cells, but in that two by two, I must put one low digit, and in that two by two, I must put one low digit. So in here, I don't have low digits, and I'm using blue for low, green for mid, and yellow for high. So there's no low digits in here. So these are made up of either mid or high. I don't know if it's one of each, but it's either mid or high. But I can go further than that, because that has two, that has two, that has one, and that has one. So there's none in here. This is mid or high, and the same is true, two here, two here, one here, 
one here. So this is mid or high. Okay, so can I do the same down here? Well, actually, can I... There's two high in here, but there's one high in here, which is leaving me with three. So that's not enough. But I've got two mid here and two mid here. One mid in here, one mid in here. So there's no mid in here. This is low or high. But I've also got two high in here, two high in here, a high in here and a high in here. This can't be high either. These are two low digits. Can I go further? I, I don't think I could do further than that. Mid here, there must be a mid in here. There must be a mid in here. There must be a mid in here. There cannot be a mid in here. So these are low or high, and there cannot be a mid in here because there's two mid in here, there's two mid in here, there's two mid in, uh, a mid in here and a mid in here. So this is low or high only. But this is too low. So these are mid high and must be one of each. And I mark them to indicate one of each. And this must be have a low and a high. So this is a low and a high and must be one of each. And I can do the, whoops, I'm in the wrong mode. I can do the same here. There's two low here. There's two low here. There must be a low here. There must be a low here. So there's no low here. This is a, this, this is made up of only mids and highs. So this can't be low. So one and two are in there only. But mid, there must be a two mid in here, two mid in here, one mid in here, one mid in here. There's no mid here. These are two highs. But two lows in here, two lows in here. There must be a low in here and there must be a low in here. So there's no low in those. So that's only high or mid. This can't be high. If this was high, I'd have the highs in those positions and there's no high in that two by two because I've only got three highs in the box. That is mid. That could still be mid. But that is mid. So maybe I'm doing it here. No, because I don't have any, I've got a double low there, but I don't have another double low. I don't have, I've got a double high, but I don't have another double high, and I don't have any double mids. But I could do it in this column. There's two lows here, there's two lows here, there must be a low in here, there must be a low in here, so there's no lows here. These are, these are made up of no low. That's two highs, but I don't have the same. There's two highs here, there's two highs here. But I can't do the same trick because I can't make other two by two squares in these columns. So I can't do the trick again in these columns because I could literally put a high there and then the entire column is fine and I've done it with only five and I've still got another high I can put anywhere. So I can't knock a high out of any digits. And same true here, I think. I oh, know, I could do it here. This can't, this is two mids. There's a mid here, there must be a mid here, there must be a mid here. There cannot be a mid here. These are only low or high. Now I've got these two highs. Can I replicate that over here? How did I get that? I got those from this row. No, I, can't, I got it from the five, six, four, five, two, three, and one, two, but this is way 
less powerful. Because I have to put one hot, two highs in here, one in here, one in here. I've used four. If I put one in here, I've still got one I can put in there. So I don't have the same thing. But with these two highs, where do I put the other high in this box? If I put it in any of these three cells, then there's no high down here. If I put it in either of these two cells, there's no high up here. So it's in one of those two cells. So the high is in one of those two. I can get rid of the medium there. What I can do is I can say that the last high is in one of those two. That can't be a high because that's a high, that's a high, and one high in here. That's not a high. That's the only place in the box for a seven. And there are eights and nines in here, but this can only be an eight or a nine, which means there is an eight up here. But that can't be high. Because if this was high, while I'm covered for two by twos, there are three highs in here. And then I can't, this would have to be low and mid. It doesn't work. You can never put three of the same thing into a two by two. So this can't be high. So this is high. So this is the eight, nine. And this is an eight, nine pair. So there's a low in one of those two. There's a low in one of those two. So right, important things. You can never put three of the same entropy or the same, yeah, entropy into the, a two by two. Mmm. That's huge, because look at this. I've got to put two and three in here. So I can't put one in here with it because you can never put three of the same entropy into a two by two or else you can't fit the other two entropies. So I can't put one in here and none of those could be low. That's a one. And I think I do the same down here. I can't put six in here with four or five or I couldn't fit a low on a high digit and I, none of those can be medium. That's a six. Three is in one of those two. Because I can't put three in here with the one and two. Three is in one of those two. There is a six in one of these and a four in one of these. This has got one or three in it. Possibly both. Because these are the only ones I know contain one of each.
So, two is down here, but I can put a low digit on here. This is mid. And it can't be a six, it's four or five, because the six must be up here. Do I know anything about that? Well, four in this box can't go in with the five, six, and it can't go here. So four is down here. And I can I repeat that trick here? No. Can I repeat it here? Because I was wondering about the four here, because four can't go in those cells. So it's in one of those. But I don't have anything restricting fours. Threes, however, can't go here. So three is in one of those. I've already got the twos here. Sixes, fives. Part of me wants to say there's a four in here. But I can't see how to prove that. And all of these are horizontal. If this is a three, is the question what happens if the three is here? Because if the three is here, that makes this a two, three pair. because I need to put a two, three. I couldn't, can't put a two here because of this quadruple. And if I put a three in either of those, I can't put threes there. This would be a two, three pair, which means there'd be a one down here. So there'd be two, three here, and there'd be a one down here, which would put a one in one of those two. One couldn't be there because I need a one in this quadruple. So the two, three would be there and that'd be a one and that doesn't work. Okay, well, that's tricky. I'm not sure if it's... If I put a three in either of those, this becomes a two, three pair. Two, three pair here means that the one around this quadruple needs to cover this two by two and this two by two. So it goes there. This becomes two, three, one, and I've got three low digits in here. So this would have to be both medium and high and it doesn't work. I can't put three in either of those two. That's a three. This is not a three. So this is a low digit. And there must be a low digit in here and it must be the two. So this is two, seven, eight, nine. Uh, I don't like that. Let's just say that it must be have a two on it. So there must be a mid in here. There must be a mid in here. One and two are in here. Well, I can't make both of those one, two. Because if this was three, two, one here. Yeah, if this was three, two, one, there'd be no low in any of those. So this can't be three, two, one. So this has to be one of the ones, one, twos. And now there's no mid in that two by two. So this becomes mid. And it can't be four or five. That's a six. This can't be a two because of the twos looking across. That's the one. That's the two. This is a four five pit. That's insane. The fives are looking across putting five in one of those two. This is two mids. This must be a low and a high. So I mark this as low high, but I connect it because that's one of each. There's no mid, whoops, don't do that. There is no mid in here. That must be mid and it must be four, five. 
And that gives me the four, five, six, triple. It can't be a four. The four is down here. That's a five. There's a six in one of those two, which means there's a six in one of those two. This is one of each, so this could be either. But this can't, uh, couldn't be, no, it could be three. Two is in one of those two. Five is in one of those two. There must be a mid in here. There must be a low in here. There must be a low in those. Could I make both of those low? I think it would do a lot of pressure, but it might work. There's, no, these aren't forced to be one of each. They're, they're just possible highs or, or mediums. Two is in one of those. One is in one of those two. So there must be a low in one of these two. For this, I can't put it up here because this sees one, two, and three. So there's a low down here and it must be a two or a three. If it's a two, it's there. If it's a three, it could be an either. If, it, if that was a three... No, that'd be fine. I couldn't put a three there because then this would be two, three. So if it's a two, it's there. If it's a three, it's there. But the low, can, I just don't know enough. This can't be an eight. How did I knock... Oh, eight must be on this. The, the eight quadruples here means this isn't an eight. Because if this was an eight, eight would have to go there and there and it doesn't work. That's not an eight. That's an eight. So that is a high digit. There must be a low digit in this two by two and I cannot put a low digit there because it can't be one, two or three. That is a low digit. And the same is true here. I need to put a low digit in that two by two and I can't put it there, there or there. That is a low digit. So these are from one, two, three. Now I need a low digit that covers this two by two and this, oh no, I don't. Yeah, I do. This two by two needs a low digit. This two by two needs a low digit. If I put a low digit here, this two by two doesn't have one. If I put a two here, this two by two, first of all, these can't be two. This is a one, three pair, which means the three is up here and the one is up here. But, because the two must be up here because of the quadruples. But if I put the two here, where's the low in here? And if I put the two here, where's the low in there? It doesn't work. These aren't twos. This is the two. And this is a low digit. That gives me all the lows in the column. This isn't a one. This is a one, three pair. That's a one, which is a low digit. One of these must be high. This is medium or high, and that is one of each.
eight is down here. But again, because of these quadruples, it's not in one of those two. Because these eights are restricting it. This one makes this the three and this the one. Three, three puts three in one of these two. And I... So three is now in here. Because I can't put three in here and I can't put three in here. Because if I put make this two, three, three, I'd have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven low digits in order to make it work. And I can't do it. So I can't put another three around this quadruple. So this has to have three around it. So this is three, five, six, eight, because it must have eight. This is three, five, six, and eight. I know there's no eight there. I know there's no five there. Wait, I removed eight. There's no five there. So these are three, five, six, and eight. So this digit can't be one, two, three, could be four, can't be five, six, could be seven, can't be eight, could be nine. So it's only four, seven, or nine. Sorry, this is melting my brain. This two is looking down saying there's no two in any of those. That's a two. So that's good. This now doesn't have a, high, a, a medium digit. That is medium, which means this has to be high. So this is isn't the six, this is the six, that is medium. This has got one of everything. There has to be a seven in one of those two. A seven here would put a seven here. Should put a seven in one of those two. Yeah, it seems okay. This has got one of everything. This must be one of each. This must be a medium and a high, and it must be one of each. If that's the high digit, it's a seven. If that's the high digit, it's a nine. In fact, nine is in one of those two, because where do I put the, the nine? I can't put it in with the seven or eight. I'd have three high digits and I can't put it in. Nine is in one of those two. This is four or five only. There must be a low... This can't be the three. If this was the three, there's no low, low digit in that two by two. This is the three. That is a low digit. This two is saying that's not the two, that's the two, which is a low digit. These are medium and high and must be one of each. If that's the high digit, it's a seven. If that's the high digit, it's a nine. Same as here. So the seven, wow, this is... Oh, the three here takes the three out of those. That's a five, six pair, which are both medium. So this is a three, eight pair. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. This is a six, nine pair. So these are four, five, and seven. There's no five there. So this is four or four or seven. For the row, that's six, that's seven, that's four, that's nine, that's five, six, seven, four, 
five nine seven. That seems to be okay. This there's a five six here. That can't be a four. If that was a four, there'd be three middle digits. That's not a four. That is a seven or a nine, which is a high digit. This must be a low digit, and it can't be two or three. That's the one. This is not the one. It's four, five, seven, or nine. It's not five. It's four, seven, or nine. There must be a nine in one of those two. These are one of each. Those two, I'm using a different color because that two by two needs one of each. No. Sorry, I was thinking, hang on, I could mark fives in this box, but they're already there. Oh, that's not the one. That's the one. Because of that one. If that was three, I think we're broken. If that's three... Two can't go here because I've then got th too many lows. And if I put down here, there's no, uh, there's no low in here. This can't be the three. So three is in one of those two. If that's the three, I could put two there and I'm now good. I could even, I can't put two there. I could put two there. If that's the three, I could put two there and I'm still good. Three is in one of those two. Hmm. So I'm looking for where I don't have entropy. This is seven, eight, nine. These can't both be low. Right. None of those can be mid. One, two, three, four, five, six cells. Sorry, that one can. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is a mid digit and it's not five or six. That's the four. So these are one of each. This is low or high and it's one of each. I can change that back to the yellow. But this is also one of each. Holy cow. Because I've got two highs and two lows already. This can't be two of the same. How do I use this? Is there a quadruple trick I've missed somewhere? Yes. Yes, there is. That can't be a seven because of the one seven quad. That's the nine. There's no nine there. This is a four seven pair. Does that nine do anything? This is high. 
This is a four seven pair. So there's two mids in here. Can I put three mids? I think I can put three in a row, can't I? I don't think there's a problem with three in a row. That's seven, that's seven. And we'd have mid, mid, high. Mid. I think... There must be a mid in here, and it's got to be four or five. <sighs> one must be in one of those two. One must be in one of those two. So one is in the corner. That is low. Again, I was just... Okay, so let's do more Sudoku. Let's do more Sudoku. Two and two. Two is down here, but none of those can be low. That's a two, which is a low digit. Three, three, I've already got, but none of these are low. This is one of each. This is low or high. And I can mark that one as being different. But that's a one in the corner. I've marked that with the wrong blue. This has been marked with the wrong blue. There must be a three in here now. So this can't be low anymore. If this was low, there's a two in here and there's no low in here. This is definitely high. If this is low, it's three. There is a three in one of those. Which means three is in one of those digits. Well, the way to think about it is where's three in this row now? It must be in one of those. So there must be a two in here. So this is two, four, five. Is there another digit forced into there? It's two, four, five. It needs to have a high digit in it. And it can't be eight. But I think it could be either seven or nine at this point. But what I can ask is where is three in this column? Can't be in any of those because three is down here for the row. It can't be in any of those because that's two, four, seven. It can't be in either of those. They can't be low. That's the three. This is not the three. I feel there's some simple entropy thing I am missing. <laughs> simple. Simple. Yes, there is. Look down here. Where's the low in this three in this two by two now? That can't be high. That's low. And this is one of each. So that is high. Sorry, high. So this is one of each. So that is low. And that's colored this. This is the two. This is the three. This is not the two. This is a seven, eight, nine. This is a seven, eight, nine. This is six, eight, nine, because I can't use seven. Seven is in one of those two, but I can now get rid of those lines. They are done. Now, what did they give me? There must be a mid in here, but I already knew there was one of each here. There's one of each in here. There's one of each in here. There's one of each in here. It doesn't tell me about that, I don't think, because that cell, whatever that is, if that's mid, those are... If that's mid, that's mid. If that's high, that's high. Those are the same. This four makes this five and this four, which puts four 
up in one of those three. Five is also up here. So this can't be mid. It sees four, five, and six. That is a high digit. So it's seven, eight, nine. There must be a high in here. Ah, the three. Can't be in here and it can't be in here. That's the three. That is the low digit. There must be a mid in this two by two and that cell sees all three mids. So it can't be in any of those. That can't be high. This is mid and it's four or five. Hang on. I can't put four or five in any of those cells. That's a four, five pair. There's no three here. These are two, seven, eight, nine. Which is going to cover everything. Except this two by two needs a high digit. That's high. That's low. That's the two. This is the seven, eight, nine. But that two by two. This two by two needs a high. That one's already complete. Two is now in one of those two because of the two, three looking across. This three means this is the one and this is the three, which means that's not the one. That's the one by Sudoku. So it's not hot. That's low. I don't know that this is, ah, yes, I do know it's one of each because there's now one, two, three here. That's high. This doesn't have a high digit. That's a high digit. So these are both mid digits and I can get rid of those lines, but that tells me about this digit because there must be a mid in here. So I've got one, two, three mids. That is a high digit, which means it's not a five. That's the five. This sees five. So it's four or six. This is seven, eight, nine. This two by two is complete. This two by two must uh, is complete. This is seven, eight, nine. This is seven, eight, nine. Actually, these are eight and nine because the two high digits here must be eight, nine. These are just eight and nine. So seven is in one of those three. So where is seven on this quadruple? It can't be in those because the seven looking up, that's the seven. That's an eight, nine pair looking down, making that a seven, taking seven out of there. Seven is in one of those two. And I can't make that a seven. Oh yeah, that's not a seven now. That's an eight, nine pair because of the seven in the box. I was about to do something clever I didn't need to do. That's an eight, nine pair, making that a six, making that a middle digit, which means this needs to be a high digit in order for multiple reasons. First of all, it couldn't be a six. Second of all, I needed a high digit in that two by two. These are only from four, six, and seven. There's no six in either of those. That's the four, that's the seven, that's the six by Sudoku. So that is a high digit, that is a middle digit. But now this two by two needs a middle digit. This two by two needs a high digit. I can get rid of those lines, but then I can pencil mark, that's high, so it's seven, that's mid, so it's six. The six means that's the nine, which means it's the high digit, and this needs a middle digit, which means that's the four and that's the seven, meaning that's the high digit and I can get rid of that line. This is not a seven. This is a four, five pair, meaning that is mid. And the four is looking up, making that the five and that the four. This nine is looking down, making that the eight, which makes that the nine. I need to put a nine around the quadruple, meaning that's the nine and that's the eight. These are now known. Five and eight. That's a five, eight pair. 
So where's the seven around this quadruple? It's right there, meaning that is a high digit. Seven is in one of those two by Sudoku. This is a known digit. That's a six, which just has not been placed yet. Which unfortunately completes those all of those two by twos. There still must be a high digit in here. Actually, I know what these two digits are. One, two, three, four, five, and eight. That's a five, eight pair. Giving me a five, eight pair in the row. But these are four and nine. I think I'm going to get rid of that coloring now. Same as I'm going to get rid of that coloring now. Because the digits which are locked into pairs are giving me the same thing. These, oh, this eight is making that the nine and that the eight and that the nine. So this is a pair, two, four. This is a pair, three, eight. Don't need the coloring. So this is a pair. There's no two in here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No, it's not. I've broken the puzzle. Where did I break the puzzle? This isn't 2-4. No, I see what I did wrong. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. These are 3 and 8. I'm comfortable with that. Let's do these again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. These are 4 and 7. And these are two and five. That's better. Is it a quadruple thing? I don't see how. Okay, so this is a five, eight pair. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So this is four or nine only. There must be a middle digit in here. Where's six in this row? Yeah, where's six? This is a two, six pair. So these are four, seven, and nine. Ah, got it. That two by two. Where's the high digit on it? These are both middle. That's low. That needs to be high, which means that's eight and that's three, which is low. The eight looks down, making that three and that eight. So that's low and that's high. This needs a high digit. So that's seven and that's four. So that's high and that's mid. This needs a middle digit. So that's five and that's two. So this is mid and that's low. The five looks up making that six and that five. The six looks up making that two and that six. So that's low and that's mid. This needs a high digit in it. That's the nine, which is high. That looks across making this four, which is mid, which makes this nine, which is high. There's no nine in either of those. Wrong mode. The four seven pair is looking across making this the five and this the four. The nine is looking across making this the eight and this the nine. The eight is looking across making this five, which is mid, which makes this eight, which is high, which makes this five, which is mid, which makes this eight, which is high. And the four seven pair is resolved by either of those. The seven looks up making that the four, which is mid, which makes this the seven, which I should have done the coloring first, which is high. And now we'll go back in here. I've solved the puzzle correctly. We who it's yeah this couple three months ago this was first tested that is stunning tricky you really need to understand global entropy to do this one i think this is going to be a trek three maybe even a trek four this is a tricky puzzle this is possibly the hardest global entropy puzzle i've ever done you really need to understand the constraints to make this one work, but it's beautiful. 
Well, thank you, Ron Plana, for your contributions to the pack. But wow, tricky puzzle. There's so many puzzles in this pack that deserve to be more widely seen. I really hope people will just share this pack with everyone because holy cow. Thank you, everyone, for watching. Um, as always, good luck with your solving.